Arr, guys. Do you want to know something fun? Hold on, let me just get you to stay there for a minute. Do you want to know something absolutely, like, fantastically amazing? Yeah? Well, Wales, where I live, please just ignore the background. I'm not feeling too good. I'll explain on that in a minute. But, guys, Wales, where I live, if any of you are in Wales, I know a couple of you guys are in Wales. But Wales, where I live and we live, have been put back into a tier 4 lockdown. Meaning, like, five days, that's better, about, how many days is it till Christmas? It is 20 to the, we have five days till Christmas. Wales has been put back under lockdown, meaning that anything that we don't have right now for Christmas, we cannot get it unless it's click and collect. Meaning that all shops are now closed, apart from supermarkets and essential shops. Anything that is non-essential has been shut off in supermarkets in general, like toys, stuff like that, guys, has all been shut off. Everything, Christmas, why, 2020, why coronavirus why it's so depressing i hate it it's doing my head in now guys i'm fed up like half of this year i've spent in a lockdown seriously this is our what third fourth lockdown now and it's just not getting better like they've put us in a lockdown because of a new strain that's come out like the the, the this new strain is apparently more um more contagious than the last strain even though the last strain was meant to be like stupidly contagious this strain is now like even more contagious than the last strain it's not any worse apparently it's exactly the same virus and for some reason it's decided to come out just before christmas where i live in right now in swansea uk wales it is at its highest like the amount of people who has got it, the amount of people I know personally. When this first came about, I didn't know anyone who's got it. Like, I was honestly that person who was like, maybe it's not real. Maybe it's just a flu and, you know, they're classing it as coronavirus. But having it myself, and then since I had it, like, the amount of people who I know personally who's got it, it's unreal. It's really starting to bug me now, guys. Like, this whole entire coronavirus thing is really starting to bug me. And the fact that we've been put in a lockdown. We're, but, 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 wait. The funny thing is, okay, we've been put in a lockdown from last night. Okay, yesterday. Yesterday, we, we, we've all been Wales has been ready to be put in a lockdown on the 23rd or the 28th of uh, December. Okay, that was the last thing we knew. Um, yesterday, at about 5 o'clock... Something like that, about five, four, five, something like that. We got told that we was going into another lockdown. So about five o'clock yesterday, everyone rushed out, made massive gatherings to be put on a lockdown because we need to get Christmas presents for kids, for families. You know, Santa is still about whether or not we have coronavirus, whether or not this world is being... Whether or not this world's going through a pandemic right now, Santa is still real, you know. We can't have... What we meant to say to, like, kids five and under, oh, Santa's not coming this year why um he's got coronavirus like come on <sighs> it's doing my head and i'm so ready for it to just be over and the thing is we're all like oh 2020 2021 is going to be the year i'm looking forward to 2021 we ain't having 2021 2021 is going to be the exact same definitely in the uk if you're out of the uk like i know australia are pretty good right now they they're almost back to normal and a lot of other countries as well i'm not sure what the usa is like i'm i'm pretty sure they haven't had many um of a lockdown since but uk They've dealt with it so stupidly, and the fact that we've just been put into another lockdown just before Christmas is like, why wasn't things sorted out sooner? Why is it now that they're realising how bad it's got? Because it's ridiculous. It is absolutely ridiculous right now. I'm over it. <laughs> Seriously, I am honestly... I just need to rant to you guys and let you guys know what's going on because it is ridiculous right now. Definitely where I live is absolutely ridiculous. I am so ready for... I'm ready for 2022. 2021 is going to be the exact same. We, we're in lockdown now um, until like sometime next year. They say three weeks. I think they review it, but we ain't getting out in three weeks time. We're going on, like my mum's self-employed and she's been told to start looking um, at things in March. Okay, so that's January, February, March. We've been told about possibly another lockdown in March. So <sighs> I'm so ready for this year to get over with. Seriously, I, I'm done with this year. Anyone else feeling the same? Because I'm pretty sure half of the people who are inside the UK 
can tell you how friggin' depression there is right now. Like, there's only so much that we can we can do. Like, I'm not an out person. Okay, when we first went into lockdown in March, I was like, this is nothing. I'm I'm used to staying in the house. I spend all my days in the house recording videos or help my mum because she works from home and all this kind of stuff. Okay, that that that's me. I'm not an out person. I don't go out. I don't. I rarely go out. The fact of how long it's been postponed, how the fact how how long, how many times we're going into the same routine, how many times like I've watched everything on Netflix, okay? I, I I've literally I'm ready to cancel my Netflix subscription because I've seen everything on there, okay? Like that's how bad and how bored it is to get in. It's so annoying, and the thing is. The more we go into these lockdowns, the more people aren't listening because no one, everyone's fed up. Everyone's fed up of being stuck in the house. So people are just going out and doing what they normally do day to day because we're fed up of being stuck inside the house. I'm sorry, like, I understand where we're coming from. I understand why they're doing it because it is a horrible thing. I, I went through it, I've had it, and I, I'm currently still not feeling 100%. I, I've got really bad chest problems right now and I feel like I might have a chest infection, but you know like i can see why they're doing it but the way that they're doing it they just need to lock us up for like a couple of months stop everything and then slowly like they but they tried that like i don't know where the uk has gone wrong but they've gone wrong somewhere and it's really friggin annoying and i feel sorry for people who are out there working i feel sorry for nhs staff i feel sorry for people who are isolated and not seeing their family like i this christmas Oh, this year like I think I've seen my nan and my family who are vulnerable like once or twice like um, this year is gonna be the first year that we're not celebrating it as a family and it's friggin horrible I am so ready for 2022 that's all I can say 2021 is gonna be the exact same I'm not looking forward to it like I'm my point is me and my partner has been trying to go to Russia because we want to go to Chernobyl Okay, um, it, we've been putting it off for years anyway because none of us like flying. So we've been putting that off. We've been putting it off for years, and we was gonna plan it for this year. And we were, then like all everything kicked off. So we was like, okay, never mind. We'll do it for next year. So we've been thinking about it, right, and like we ain't getting out there until 2022. There's no way that we're getting out of this country next year. Like if we do, we're gonna have to quarantine and all this kind of stuff, and it's it's not worth it. It's really not worth it. I'm so ready for next year. But anyway, um, I also have chest problems now. It's been about a week since I've been fully rec well, not fully, but feeling much better since I had coronavirus. Um, but the last two days, oh my god, I've had as any like, please, if you've had coronavirus, please tell me that this is normal because my chest has been absolutely killing. I've had pains all across here. Um, and it feel I feel really like full of mucus, and when I'm coughing, I feel like I'm just coughing up mucus. It's disgusting, but it hurts and it's really frustrating because I don't know whether I need to phone like the, the hospital and ask them for information or whether I just need to get back in bed and ride it out for another couple of days. Like I really don't know, but that's all I want to know. That's all I do want is that I, I just want to be better for Christmas. I just want to celebrate Christmas. It's bad enough that I can't smell for Christmas. <laughs> Like, the fact of having to be ill over Christmas is bad. I'm not looking forward. I'm hoping... I'm going to phone the doctors tomorrow if I need to. But I'm hoping that I'm just... It's just normal. And it's just meant to happen. It's just coming out of me, if that makes sense. Anyway, my rant's over, guys. Um, I just... I just needed a rant to someone. I put it on Facebook and everyone just starts jumping down my throat saying I'm being selfish. And I'm not. I'm just... This is how I feel. This is how 2020 has made me feel. It's making me feel so depressed and so anxious and so fed up that... I'm just ready for two years time. The only good thing is, is that I'm now back on lockdown, meaning that I have no way of going outside. Like I cannot go out. So more videos, more uploading, and I'm gonna start live streaming. Um, I'm gonna start doing this somehow. I think I'm gonna get another PlayStation because I've currently got an Xbox. And if you have Xbox, you'd realize how friggin' hard it is to live stream without a PC. And I don't have a PC at the minute that will be able to stream. So I think I definitely need another Xbox, PlayStation. So I'm hoping when I get paid on the 23rd, that's another thing that's not done my head in. Like I've been putting some presents off until the 23rd because that's when I get my payment. And now it's like, can't even do anything. Can't even buy offline because they're not going to be here in time. So I might buy a PlayStation 4. I'm not, I'm not going to bother with the 5. 
my buying PlayStation 4 just to um, start live streaming to be honest with you because I feel like I want to, I just want to and I'm fed up of just doing nothing so I want to live stream. Anyway guys I'm going to end it here, I love you all, just be positive, don't be me, just see the good outcome and see the fact that everyone's going to get better if we all go into a lockdown and the spread is going to chill out a bit so yeah, anyway, bye guys.